life. One, making telephone calls. Dialogue one. Hello, good morning. Who is that speaking? It's Jane. I'm so sorry that I made such an early phone call. It's nothing. Who do you wish to talk to? Is Sue in? Sue, Jane wants you on the phone. Hello, is Sue there? Yes, speaking. Oh, sorry, I'm afraid I won't attend the meeting this morning. Last night I had a sore throat and I started getting hot. Don't worry about the meeting. You'd better go to see a doctor. I wish you will be well soon. Thank you, Sue. Bye. Hang on, okay? Let me see if he's here. Sorry, he's not available right now. Do you have any idea where he is? Sorry, I don't know. Do you know when he will be back? He should be back in 30 minutes. Can I leave a message? Of course. Hold on for just a second so I can grab the pen and paper. When he comes back, can you have him call me at 206-555-1212? Can you repeat again, please? 206-555-1212. I'll have him call you as soon as he's back. Good afternoon, madam. What can I do for you? Yes, I want to buy some postcards. Do you know where I can get them? Yes, you can buy them here. We have three kinds of postcards. One dollar, two dollars, and five dollars. Which one do you want? Oh, can I have a look at them? Yes, please. Hmm, I want this card. Is it two dollars each? Yes, how many do you want? Three. This is ten dollars here. Here's your change. Thank you. One more question. I can send my postcards from this post office, right? Yes, madam. Our office hour is from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. every day. Okay, thank you very much. You are welcome. Good morning, sir. Can I help you? Yes. I want to send this package to Beijing. Which window should I go to? Go to the window marked Parcel Post. Thanks. I want to send this package Parcel Post, registered. What does it contain? There are three books. Do you want it insured? Yes, please, for $30. That will be 60 cents. Here are your stamps. Thanks. Wait a second, sir. Yes? You forgot to put the return address on the package. Oh, sorry. I'll put it on right now. Now, here is your receipt. Good morning, sir. How can I help you? Yes. I'd like to withdraw some money from this account. Okay. How much do you want? $500. Can you fill out this form, please? You need to write down your name, your account number, how much money you want. Sure. Hold on for a moment. Here you are. Thanks. Sir, please enter your password over that machine. Okay. I'm sorry, sir, but your password is wrong. Really? Can I try it again? How about this time? It's correct now. Here's your receipt. Please sign at the bottom of it. Okay, here you are. Here are $500 and your account. Please press the button to give a score for my service. Thank you. Excuse me, sir. Yes, may I help you? I'd like you to cash this check for $100, please. Do you have an account with us? No, actually, I'd like to open an account right now. What kind of account would you like to open? A checking account. Please fill in these forms. Can I have your ID card to make a copy? Yes, sure. Here you are. Thanks. Please finish these forms. I'll be right back. Thank you.
Did you finish the forms? May I have them back? Yes, here you are. Now, how would you like this check cashed, ma'am? Ten tens will be fine. Here you are. Excuse me, does this bus go to the newly built cinema? No, you'll have to get off at the bookstore and take number 39. Thank you. How much is the fare to that stop? One dollar. How many stops are there? Three stops, including this one. That's not too bad. By the way, do I need a transfer again after number 39? No, a number 39 will take you right there. Thank you. Excuse me, I've been waiting here for 15 minutes. Do you know how often number 9 runs? Oh, it runs every 20 minutes. You must have missed one when you came here. It would be here any minute now. Oh, okay. Thank you. Do you mind if I ask you where you are going? I'm going to the hospital. Okay. Actually, you can take both number 9 and number 12 to the hospital. Really? That sounds great. By the way, do you know where I can find a bus schedule? You can go to the transportation department to get yourself a bus schedule and a bus routine map. It's just around the corner. I see. Thank you very much. Can I have two tickets? To which station? Oh, we are going to the art gallery? Which subway should we take? Take the line five and transfer to line one at the central bank. Okay, how many stops in total? Ten stops. This is the subway map. You can keep it in case of getting lost. Thank you. How much are the tickets? Two dollars each. Here you are. Here are your tokens. Have a good day. Excuse me. Can you tell me how I can get a subway ticket? Go to the auto machine over there. I'm a newcomer here. Can you show me how to use it? Sure. You need two $1 coins. Put them in the slot and click one ticket button on the screen. It's very easy. Okay, but I don't have any coins. Where can I get some? You can change some at the service center. Can they take a $20 bill? I think so, but you need to ask them. Okay, I think I can handle it. Thank you very much. Taxi! Get on, please. Where do you want to go? Please hurry. I'm late. I need to be at the railway station in 20 minutes. All right, miss. Take it easy. How exactly do you figure out the fare? According to the kilometer rate, the first three kilometers are $10 and every kilometer extra costs you $2. Oh, I see. Here we are, miss. Thank you. How much do I owe you? You owe me $28. That's $30. Keep the change. Thank you. Dialogue 2. Hello. Hello. Is this Taxi Service Center? Yes, sir. What can I do for you? I'm going to the airport tomorrow. I want to book a taxi. Okay. Can you tell me when you need it? My flight is at 10 o'clock in the morning, so I think the taxi should pick me up at 7.30. 7.30 a.m., no problem. Where can the driver find you tomorrow morning? Number 345 York Street. By the way, do I need to pay any extra for my suitcases? Yes, you are charged $1 a piece. I see. Thank you. I've just been robbed. Can you help me? Yes. Are you injured, miss? No, I'm just scared. Stay calm, miss. Can you tell me your name and where you are? My name is Emily Davis. I'm calling from Motel 23 on Pine Street. Please stay there. Our officers will meet you in less than three minutes. Thank you very much. What can I do for you, sir? I lost my backpack. Do you know when you lost it? About 20 minutes ago, I think. Can you still remember where you saw it last time? 
I put it down on that chair, and after I came back from the toilet, it's gone. Okay, don't worry, sir. We will take care of it. Now, could you let me know your name? Ben Scott. Your cell number, sir? 708-6356. Okay, we will let you know when we find it. Thanks a lot. Can I help you? Yes. I got a call told me that you've found my suitcase. Hold on, sir. What's your name? Mike Jones. Okay, please follow me. Could you tell me what's in your suitcase? Some clothes and some important files in it as well. Oh, and my passport. Okay, Mike Jones? Yes, it's me. All right, sir. You can fill out the form and get your suitcase back now. Thank you very much. You are welcome. Dialogue 2. Did you see my purse? Excuse me, you lost your purse. Yes, it's brown. Is this your purse, miss? No, it's not. Don't worry. Can you describe your purse? I'll try to help you. It's a leather purse in brown, and there is a logo in the center of the surface. Okay. I got it. I'll let you know when we find it. Thank you very much. Good morning. Morning. What can I do for you? Yes, I'm a new student here. I'd like to know how to use the library. You need your student's identification to check out books. Okay. And how many books am I allowed to check out? Five books at a time. How long can I keep the books? For 42 days, including weekends. Don't pass the due day. Can I renew the books after the first 42 days? Yes, you can do it on the library website, but you can only renew once in one semester. I see. Thank you. You are welcome. Can I help you? Have you got the latest Time magazine? Yes, but it was checked out. Oh, really? I've missed it again? It's popular, you know. You want to reserve it? Yes, please. Fill out this form, and we'll send you a note when we have the book back. Thank you. Come in and sit down. What's the trouble? Doctor, I have a bad cough and a sore throat. Do you have a fever? I don't know, but I feel terrible. First, let me take your temperature. Okay. Don't worry. You are just having a bad cold. Go home to bed and take one of these pills every six hours. You'll be fine soon. I got it. Thank you. Drink more water and get a good rest. I will. Thanks again. Hello, doctor. What's wrong with you? I have a backache. Do you often suffer from the backache? No, I never had one before. How long does it last for? Almost four days. Let me see. Well, go home and get some rest in bed. It's not a big deal. Can you give me some medicine? It's really painful. Okay. Take one pill a time and three times a day. If you still feel bad in four days, come back again. Thank you. I'd like to buy a bottle of Centrum and two toothbrushes. Centrum? We have bottles of 30 and 50 tablets. What kind do you want? Give me two bottles of 50. And what kind of toothbrushes do you want? Can I have a look at them? Sure. I want this for two. Anything else? No, that'll be all. How much are they? Twenty dollars. Thanks. May I help you? Yes. I need to get this filled. Okay. Do you have a prescription card? Yes. Here it is. It will take about 10 to 15 minutes. I'll wait here. Okay. Look, that man just fell down over there. Oh, God. 
We need to see if he's okay. Hey, man, are you all right? He is not responding. We need to call an ambulance. Let me dial 911. 911 here. How can I help you? There is a man passed out. May I have your location, miss? Maple Street, near the church. Okay, miss. The ambulance will be there in two minutes. Please stay there. We'll find you. All right. Please hurry. Here is 911. Can I help you? Yes, emergency. There is a huge fire here. Stay calm, sir. Could you tell me your name and location now? My name is Smith. I'm on the corner of South Street. Okay. How many people in the house, Mr. Smith? Three people. Someone had been passed out. Please send an ambulance. All right. Our men will be there in three minutes. Please come immediately.